India, Japan and the US on Friday held an extensive discussion on Indo-Pacific region and how they can work together in improving their connectivity, infrastructure development and ensuring the peace in the strategic region where China has been trying to spread its influence. The Indo-Pacific region was the main topic of discussions during the Japan-India-America trilateral meeting of Prime Minister of India Narendra Modi, US President Donald Trump and Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe on the sidelines of G20 summit. The US has been pushing for a broader role by India in the strategically important Indo-Pacific region that contributes two-thirds of the global GDP and accounts for 60% of the global GDP. India, the US and several other world powers has been talking about the need to ensure a free, open and thriving Indo-Pacific in the backdrop of China's rising military maneuvering in the region. China has been trying to expand its military presence in the Indo-Pacific, which is a biogeographic region comprising the Indian Ocean and the Western and the Central Pacific Ocean, including the South China Sea. China claims almost all of the South China Sea, which also relates and includes Vietnam, the Philippines, Malaysia, Brunei and Taiwan have the counterclaims over the seas. Last month, a top official of the US, Japan, India and Australia met in Thailand, Bangkok and held consultations on their collective efforts for a free, open and inclusive trade in the Indo-Pacific and reaffirmed their shared commitment to preserving and promoting the rules-based orders in the region. In November 2017, India, the US, Australia and Japan gave a shape to the long pending quad coalitions to develop a new strategy for keeping the critical sea route in the Indo-Pacific free of any influence. The Prime Minister Narendra Modi on Friday voiced its concern over the energy security and the peace in the strategic Persian Gulf region as he discussed the ranging of US-Iran tension with President Donald Trump. Modi-Trump meeting here on the sidelines of G20 summit came at a time of a heightened tension between the Iran and the US, which has accused Tehran of being behind a series of operations against oil tankers in the highly sensitive Gulf waters. Last week, the Pentagon said that the Iran force had shot down the US surveillance drone. Prime Minister Modi of India in his initial remarks mentioned Iran as one of four topics he would discuss with President Donald Trump. Briefing the media and Modi Trump talks, Foreign Secretary of India Vijay Gokhale said the primary focus was on how to ensure the stability in the Persian Gulf region. It is that instability affects us in many ways, not just in terms of our energy needs but in terms of very large diaspora that we have in the Gulf. 8 million Indians in the Gulf region and economic interest. The two leaders agree that they and their officials will continuously remain in touch to ensure that the region remains stable and I think that is in our interest and in the interest of the United States in the interest of the region. Prime Minister outlined our energy concerns as well as our concerns regarding the peace and stability in the region, said Vijay Gokhale. Prime Minister Modi pointed out that although Iran supplied 11% of country's energy requirements, India had reduced the oil imports from Iran but these were despite the effect it had on the Indian economy, we had been able to sustain this position. We also had our diaspora in the region, we have energy requirements of the region, we have economic interest in the region. And therefore, it is India's fundamental interest to ensure the peace and stability of the region. Modi also told Trump that India has deployed some of its naval ships in the region to protect the Indian flagged vessels passing through the Gulf and the Straits of Hormuz. This was appreciated very much by the President Donald Trump of US, and they had a brief discussion. The President expressed his hope and that the oil price would remain stable. He talked about what United States was doing to ensure the stability 
was maintaining the Gulf and that oil prices were stable, said Vijay Gokhale of India. He said the both sides agreed that they would remain in touch on the issues of Iran and will continue to have a mutual discussions on how to ensure their regional peace and stability. The US reimposed some sanctions on Iran in November last after the pulling out of 2015 nuclear accord between Tehran and six world powers. To reduce Iran's crude oil exports to zero, the US ended on May to February that had allowed the top buyers of Iranian oil including India to continue their imports for six months. India has ended all the imports of oil from Iran to comply with the US sanctions. So what do you think of the trilateral meeting between the US, Japan, India or Modi, Shinzo Abe, Donald Trump on the silence of G20 summit and they also discuss about how to block China and to counter China in South China Sea and the Indo-US Pacific region. Post your comments below and if you like this video please give a thumbs up and follow us on social networks and subscribe to our channel. And thanks for watching. This is WC Daily. Think big, think different. Bye.